Hey everyone, my name is Gamer Corey, and welcome back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 online video where I want to help you guys make some more extra cash. Now, in this video specifically, we are going to be doing a treasure hunt, and I've got a few that are actually in my satchel. So let's go ahead and pull that up and let's take a look at which one we would like to go after today. So I have Diablo Ridge, which I've done a couple times, which that's kind of the one that I want to check out. And then I believe I have another one of these at the post office for Citadel Rock that we can check out at a later time. And I've already done one in East Watts, Watson, so I know where that's at. But Diablo Ridge is the one that I would like to do today. And it's not that far away. It's actually really close to Strawberry is the location that I want to go to. And I'm kind of curious to see if it's going to be in the exact same spot that the other ones have been at. Now, whether you guys are getting treasure maps from ranking up every five levels, or if you're getting them from gang hideouts, honestly, getting some extra cash in Red Dead Redemption is always a thing of beauty. So let's go ahead and make our way on over to Strawberry as best that we can. So if you guys are enjoying any of my videos, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. It would help me out a lot and is greatly appreciated. And honestly, if it wasn't for all of you guys, my channel wouldn't be anywhere where it is today. So I do appreciate each and every one of you for taking the time to check out my videos. So anyway, we're going over to Diablo Ridge. We're actually about halfway there already. So we're really not that far away from it. Now, I don't think, speaking of uh, treasure maps from hideouts, I believe I have only ever gotten one. So I'd like to hear down in the comment section or see down in the comment section if you guys have picked up any more treasure maps from, oh, I just killed something it looked like. I don't know what it was, some kind of little bird. But anyway, if you guys have picked up any treasure maps from any gang hideouts, I, I have I have an idea of things that we could do to see if we can obtain more treasure maps from hideouts, but uh, that is something that we will test in another video. So it's uh, just up here on the ridge. Believe it or not, I haven't had another Bard's Crossing treasure map again. Was I about to get ambushed there? I think I was actually about to get ambushed. I'm going to go back there and check it out real quick. I just saw a whole bunch of red that popped up on my, on my screen. Yeah, look at that. I believe this is an ambush. So we might have an opportunity right here to get another treasure map, which is kind of funny that this always seems to happen to me when... Oh, God, they're up top, aren't they? This is going to be really hard to loot them if they're up top. So anyway, we're going to take all these guys out. There we go. And then we just got the couple up top there. Oh, god damn horse. What are you doing? I can't shoot up. What are you doing, horse? Thank you. And you got one right there. I think that was it. But look at all these opportunities that we just got. And I said we were going to test it out later. I didn't mean it was going to be literally like five seconds later. That was crazy. But anyway, we're going to loot all these gang hideout people. And ambush people. And we're going to see the Driscolls, I believe, is which ones they were. And uh, we got a silver pocket watch. Not bad. Now, I have been using a little bit more of my tonics lately. So I'm trying to see if I can maybe replenish some of them. Really? Nine cents? It's not even worth my time for nine cents to even really loot any of these people. And then what I would like to do is see if I can get up on top of that hill to get those two people. But I think that they're going to despawn before I even get a chance to get up there. So far, I haven't seen a treasure map pop up on my screen. Got 12 cents and some Lancaster repeater ammunition, which is always, always good. I don't think I don't think I'm gonna be able to get up there without them disappearing. It's I think it's gonna to be too far away. I'm gonna see if I can go up this way, and we'll see if this will work. But I think it's just gonna to be too far. Otherwise, we're gonna to have to make our way over to Diablo Ridge. Oh, good, they did not they didn't despawn. Nice. All right, let's go ahead and get off the horse here real quick. They should be like right at the cliff. There we go. Loot you. Darn Driscolls. 
always getting in the way, but are going to hopefully maybe give us a treasure map. We only got one unlucky bastard here right in front of us, so let's go ahead and loot this guy real quick. Gun oil. Well, I do need that. Speaking of uh, gun oil, yikes. The condition of my guns, not so good. No wonder I can't aim worth garbage lately. All right, so let's go ahead and clean this thing real quick, and then we're going to make our way over to Diablo Ridge and get ourselves some treasure. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I actually did uh, change out my gun layout just a little bit. I put some uh, new stain or varnish on my uh, stock, so it kind of worked out pretty good. And I do will eventually change out uh, the the actual metal. I just don't know what I'm going to do yet. It, gold, I would love to do gold. It's just really, really expensive. And I haven't done enough of these treasure maps or anything else to get some extra gold. But when I was doing some of the um, posse up double XP stuff, there was some good gold that I was getting from doing things with random posses. So it might be something that I might have to check out more to get gold a little bit quicker. But Diablo Ridge is literally just right up here. And I'm going to try going to the exact same spot that I've been at a few different times and see if that treasure is there. So I actually have to make my way a little bit further into this. And it's actually going to be on the other side of it. So I'm not even going to really pay attention to my controller so much. But it was like right here. Oh, it's not. Okay, so... Wait a second. Nope. Actually, it might be right here. No, I'm not seeing it. Well, it's the skull. It's the skulls is usually what I found. And it was usually right in this area. But my, my controller is not vibrating anymore. It was vibrating more when I first came up the path. So it is clearly in a different location. But my other two that I've had in this spot... It's so hard to see in the woods, though. The other two that I've had in this general location, I've... They've been literally at the exact same spot. But if you don't believe me, go and check those videos out because it was pretty crazy. I was able to walk right up to it that last time. And I am not... It was... It, my controller was vibrating down this way. So I'm going to head on down this way just to see... Oh, yeah. See, it's vibrating now. I'm going to... Look around, see if I see anything, which I don't. But yeah, it was it was vibrating as soon as I came up this path. Okay, it's not vibrating that way, so it's got to be this way then. Oh yeah, it's definitely a little bit more pronounced right this way. Yeah, there it is. Okay, it's the same. It's the same like, I don't know skull thing as the the other ones let's go ahead and check it take a look at this thing here real quick first person here we go and yeah see it's like it's got like that uh, it almost looks like a sheep when you like stay back from here like a llama is almost what it reminds me of it's kind of like it's kind of creepy looking i mean let's be honest it's kind of weird looking but anyway, let's go ahead and loot this thing. Let's see what we get from it. And it should be on the back side over here, I believe. Yeah, right there. No, wait. Wait. Is it right? Or is it right? This right here. Oh, there it is. I could have just walked straight forward and I could have gotten it. But there we go. We got the loot box. What are we going to get inside? Looks like nothing, of course. But we're going to go ahead and take our reward. Let's grab that. What are we going to get? Wow, 0.44 for gold. Not bad. I think we've gotten higher than that. And $73. Definitely not one of my better treasure map locations. And I was really hoping that we were going to get lucky with that ambush right there. Uh, just back towards uh, Broad Broad's Crossing in this area. I just don't. I was really hoping that would be amazing, but I know that there's a few other different possibilities for ambushes around here. There's actually one right in this area that we could go and check out at some point. But yep, Diablo Ridge. I know I do have one in East Watson, which is going to be like up in here or is it here? It's, I think it's like right around this location is where it's at. And then I don't know where, oh, Citadel Rock. I was really close to that one before we even came here because I started like, like right in this area, 
which that would have been a good one. And then I don't remember where the other one is currently located. But anyway, if you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. It would help me out a lot and is greatly appreciated. But let's check out what that last one was. Kalimat Ravine. Hmm. No, I have no idea where that's at. I'll have to take a look at that one. But anyway, until next time, YouTube, you guys keep doing what you're doing because you're already doing it. And you guys, stay gaming.